in today's video i'm going to share with you five different websites where you can find sponsored nanny jobs caregiver jobs or maid jobs in canada if you are based out of canada for your permanent residency application so you want to stick around up to the very end of this video so you do not miss out as usual do your due diligence just make sure that um, you don't fall in the hands of a con man or a con woman. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm so glad that you are watching. If you're new here, welcome, Karibu. My name is Eva Mtali and on this channel we talk about all things immigration to Canada. We talk about travel and once in a while i also post my travel video vlogs so if any of these sound interesting to you you want to hit the subscribe button below and once you have done so you want to hit the notification bell as well so that every single time i shoot a new video you do not miss out so without much further ado the first place you want to look for sponsored nanny jobs in canada for foreign workers especially if you're based out of canada is the government of canada job bank so you go to jobbank.gc.ca and once you get on the landing page just click up here and type nanny and click on the browse button as you can see here i have 404 results that are related to nanny and what you're looking for is nanny or living caregiver child care jobs and you are looking for specifically verified jobs because there's also a lot of con men on the internet and you do not want to be caught in between somebody who's trying to rip you off and then if you're interested you can also filter by the specific region or province so you can see most of the jobs are in ontario british columbia quebec alberta um, these are the provinces with the most nanny jobs you can also filter by period of employment the salary the um, years of experience and all that you can filter by education or training so most of them just require secondary school or job specific training and then you can also filter by the language so you can see most of the nanny jobs in Canada require English or French but some would require for you to have both English and French and then of course you can look at the work conditions as you can see most for most of this remote work is an available so that is the first website job bank canada that is jobbank.gc.ca the next website that you can look at for sponsored visa nanny jobs in canada for foreign workers or for people outside of canada is trafalgarpersonnel.com so with trafalgarpersonnel.com basically you have to come here to for caregivers and then you click on overseas applicants so trafalgar personnel does not charge any fees for its temporary foreign worker program for care related employment and with them you can apply under two main programs that is under the home child care provider hccp pilot or the home support worker hsw pilot program so currently Trafalgar personnel will not be accepting new overseas mail applicant files because they've had difficulty in placing them in the past. So with these two paths to permanent residence in Canada as a home care worker, you will get an employment specific open work permit. That means you can only work as a home child care provider or as a home support worker okay and this means that the employer will not pay for your travel expenses and all the application costs um, related will be paid by you and um, 
what you have to do to work with Trafalgar personnel or to have them find you a sponsored nanny job in Canada. So the criteria number one, you must be at least 18 years of age. And then you have to have your education qualifications certified by the ECA certification. And then for those whom English or French is not their mother tongue, you have to have proof that you have valid IELTS certification or the French equivalent. And then, of course, you have to show proof that you can complete the duties required and work independently. So the Trafalgar specific limited requires that you have a minimum of one to two years full time employment related to the pilot you are choosing. And you must have completed this within three years of the date of your application is submitted to Immigration Canada. Then, of course, um, excellent work related letters of reference and reference check reports. So please note that Traf Trafalgar personnel does contact your present and previous employers directly to obtain reference check reports. And the only exception would be present employers if an applicant feels it would jeopardize their current employment situation. However, in that case, there must be at least one excellent reference check report on file for a minimum of one to two years related experience from at least one previous employer. So for you to request an application form for a sponsored nanny job in Canada as a foreign worker, um, especially if you're looking for employment under the HCCP and HSW pilot programs, you send an email to info at trafalgarpersonal.com and include the following information. That is your name as is on your passport, your email address, your current city and country of current address, your nationality, your previous work experience in the past three to five years, and then in summary, care related employment, noting if it was paid or volunteer work, the name, address, that is the city and the country, and then dates of employment, like when you started and the date you completed, your job title and hours of work. Then Trafalgar personnel will forward you their online application link and the application form is in two parts. So part one requires a passport size photo to be attached and part two must, part two must be completed immediately afterwards. So it includes a section for you to complete a dear family letter of introduction and requires that you attach your IELTS certification or the French equivalent, of course, unless English or French is your official mother tongue, you have to attach your ECA certification. You have to attach letters of reference related to the pilot program you wish to apply for. And then you need at least one to four casual photos mounted on a maximum of one page and any additional related certification if applicable, e.g. your driver's license, first aid or CPR certification, ECA, NNEB, if you're RN, etc. And Trafalgar Personal Limited does not charge you any fees for any of their services related to applying for, searching or securing employment in Canada as a caregiver. However, there are a few agencies overseas which forward to Trafalgar and screened files of potential applicants they have interviewed and screened. So if Trafalgar is unsure about your initial documentation received, but feel like you might meet the criteria they are looking for, then they may um, direct you to one of those agencies. And most of the agencies charge a fee. So it will be your decision whether or not you decide to register with them. But Trafalgar personnel does not knowingly work with any agency or consultancy firm that charges more than 600 US dollars for their services. Okay. Um, so if you are an applicant and you have a valid clean driver's license for a minimum of two years, you will be accepted with a minimum of one year experience and positive reference. Um, and of course, applicants who drive are always in demand and also applicants who have completed the British NNEB or HNC two-year college diploma will be accepted with no full-time paid experience if they can provide a positive reference from their college tutor and have babysitting or volunteer childcare reference on file. So the same applies for people with college diplomas related to special needs care. 
the third website whereby you can look for families that have nanny jobs is indeed.com and specifically go to the canadian site that is ca.indeed.com and just type up here families with visa sponsorship comma nanny and then click on find jobs so i have done just that and currently i have almost 841 jobs the next website that you can consider for sponsored nanny jobs in canada for foreign workers living outside of canada is greatopair.com so what you want to do is move to the left side of your screen and find jobs by country once you do so look for canada so canada is right here and then you can pick whatever country as usual here these most of the jobs are in ontario 245 and then we have quebec 57 and british columbia and alberta and then just feel free to as usual do your due diligence to make sure that those jobs actually exist next website whereby you can find sponsored nanny jobs in canada for foreign workers from outside of canada is trovit.ca so the thing about this website is that it aggregates jobs from different websites and what you want to do is just type here nanny willing sponsor click on search and you can see there's a whole lot about 95 jobs and they're all linking to different websites so for example most of them are linking to nanny services dot ca living nanny needing to start a sub willing to sponsor full-time nanny needed willing to sponsor nanny needed living only willing to sponsor there's all this living nanny needed willing to sponsor the next website that you can consider for sponsored nanny jobs in canada for foreign workers outside of canada is nannyservices.ca and what you want to do is to click here on childcare nanny babysitter jobs which gets you to this landing page and uh, for example here there is this um, employer Beatrice B who is looking for a living caregiver and is willing to sponsor if needed okay so you want to hit find a job and click on search and um, this is what you get there's this other um, employer Sean P who is looking for a living nanny needed to start a SAP and is also willing to sponsor and um, they've given all the details of the job here and uh, this is where you can make your application here by creating your profile on nannyservices.ca another website that you can consider for sponsored nanny jobs in canada for foreign workers outside of canada is canadiannanny.ca what you want to do is start off by posting your profile so that any potential families that are looking for nannies can find you so what you want to do is click on um, jobs in canada get a nanny job and once you have clicked on that you want to go all the way to the bottom left and under work eligibility click on willing to sponsor so this ensures that you filtered by those who are willing to sponsor candidates who are outside of canada and you can see now it has narrowed down from 3000 plus to 361 nanny jobs so you want to click on individual opportunities to see what works for you and the individual requirements of the families and you can also fit a filter by the work you're going to do you can filter by transportation by the training as you can see most of the families required first aid and cpr training you can filter by other services you're going to offer the family a lot of the families you'll have to do pet care sweeping supervision homework supervision and in some cases there's gardening 
and then some families have special needs um, family members that you may need to take care of there is also the language you can choose either english which is the majority there's a little french there's spanish mandarin and other languages then you can also filter by your availability whether it's a live in or live out full time or part time and also of course the age group of um, children that you're willing to work with and also the type of provider whether it's an agency or it is an individual you can also consider this website aupair.com so basically on this website you can become an au pair and find host families from Canada so what you want to do is click on what exactly you're looking for and the host family country I have filtered by Canada and then you can also filter whether you are interested in big cities or suburbs or town villages or countryside and also you can filter by the family's nationality click on all nationalities to widen your pool you can filter by the max number of children or people you take care of you can filter by your age and all this and as you can see there's different um, profiles that show up when i click on canada and you just want to view the profile and make your application so as usual to increase your chances of getting qualified register on the website as an au pair and families could contact you last but not least the website where you can get sponsored nanny jobs in canada for foreign workers is myjobsguide.com so they have a section here on job vacancies you want to hit on that and specifically in my case i was looking for caregiver for children with visa sponsorship so as you can see this employer here uh, is willing to sponsor your visa and um, has clearly said that successful applicants who are residents in countries outside canada will have their visas or work permits processing sponsored by the company so this is something you can consider as well so guys as usual make sure to do your own due diligence just to make sure um, you do not get conned or just something fishy doesn't happen to you well guys that's it for today in terms of websites whereby you can apply for or find sponsored nanny jobs in canada if you are based outside of canada for permanent residence application purposes thank you for staying up to the very end i look forward to meeting you on the next one Bye-bye.